Welcome back, baseball fans. We are in the National League for this one. Uh, we got a best of seven between the Pirates and the Cubs um, in Wrigley Field for game six. Uh, the home team won the first four games. And then uh, I just played game five, and the Cubs won on the road in Three Rivers, forcing the series back to Chicago. The Cubs just need to win one of these two to win the series in a best of seven. And today we have 1984 pitchers Rick Roden going for the Pirates and Scott Sanderson, the number four starter for the Cubs. This could be a high scoring game. So let's get started. Lee Lacey leads, the, leads it off, fouls to the catcher. Matty Alou rolls the pitcher and Sanguian grounds the second base. Matthews leads off for the Cubs. Line drive, base hit. High on base percentage. Gross. 1-5. That's double play. Beckert. His big year. Ground ball to short. Stargell, 2-4. Skies are right. Roberto Clemente gets a hit off of the Sanderson card. It's a base hit. Johnny Ray, line drive, base hit for Johnny Ray off his card. 1984 card is a shot of it. Nice looking card. Uh, first and second for Al Oliver. Bounces to short, and this is a problem. Because the good shortstop fielding shortstop, Kessinger's on the bench, and they have the backup in today. There's a 40 48. Runners move up. And Robertson with two outs. He's playing third base. Plays, flies left. All right. Sanderson gets out of the mess. Jim Hickman strikes out. Billy Williams rolls with the pitcher. Ron Santo. That's a double off of Roden's card. And it's Dernier. Dernier, homer one of 16. Doesn't have power, so that is a single that scores the run. And with two outs, the fleet-footed Dernier is going to try and steal a base, and he's thrown out. Stealing by Manny Sanguian. So we go to the third inning of a 1-0 game. Gene Tornado Alley bounces to short. Lee Lacey, he strikes out. And Matty Alou lines a short. We go to the bottom of the third. Randy Hundley, bouncer to second. Uh, this is Ray, a 3-14 at second. Okay. Here's the backup shortstop, Jerry Justet. This guy's the center. Gary Matthews, 68, ball four, off the pitcher card, and Gross with two outs, rolls with the pitcher. Not a lot of fireworks early on, one nothing in the fourth. Sanguian, here we go, homer one to 10. Take a look at this card. Yeah, that's gone. A solo shot, and the Bucks tie the game, one one in the fourth. Stargell, bouncer to short. Again, the backup shortstop, makes an error, yeah? Yeah, I hope it doesn't cost you Cubs. Roberto Clemente pops the third. Johnny Ray rolls the second. Okay, we got a 1-1 game. Bottom of four. Beckert, base hit. Yeah. Take a look at this card. His best year, 71. He started in the 71 All-Star game. Along with Hank Aaron, Willie Mays, Johnny Bench, Willie McCovey, Willie Stargell, and Glenn Beckert. And Joe Torrey. He also, Torrey, I think, hit 365 that year or something like that. Anyway, Hickman pops the third. Billy Williams, K's, and with two outs, Ron Santo bounces a short. Okay, 1-1 one, one in the fifth. Not much offense early on. Bouncer too short, this time he makes the play. Bob Robertson, a base hit. Gene Alley, 111, holy smokes. The two, the light hitting, number nine hitting, 244 hitting Gene Alley. With a clean double off his own card. Take a look at this horrible card, but he's the Pirates starting shortstop, batting ninth. Bob Robertson holds a third. All right, so Lacey is an eight bunner. They got to bring it up here in this case, and he bounces the second, and Beckert's good. He's a 2 e 10. And the runners hold with the infield up, and it's Matty Alou with two outs and ducks in the pond, and a base hit in the left field. One run scores, Alley. He's being waved home against Billy Williams and 18. Let's check it out. Alley, he is out. Thrown out at the plate by Billy Williams. So that is 
one run scores. Gene Alley gets thrown out. And it's 2 on Pirates. Bottom of the fifth. Dernier uh, bounces the short. Randy Hundley. This guy's left. Gary Jessup. This guy's left. Sixth inning. We got Sanguian, home and earlier. Another hit off his card. It's a base hit. Stargell. This guy's a center. Roberto Clemente. There's a base hit. Of course you want to take a shot at this beautiful card, right? Yeah. Two on. One out. Johnny Ray. And Johnny Ray off his card you saw earlier. Doubles on his power number, number to center field. Clemente, does he want to score from first base on a double? He's going to try it. And he does. And it's Pirates 4-1 in the sixth inning. And that's it for Scott Sanderson. Wheels started coming off the cart in the middle innings for Scott. And he leaves a runner at second base and a 4-1 deficit. And the Cubs will send Larry Gura out there in the sixth, try and get things finished. Al Oliver. Runner at second, one out. Oliver Kays. Two outs, Bob Robertson. 38's a walk. Two on, two outs for Gene Alley at the big double last inning. Single one to 11. Singles here. That puts, that loads the bases. And here's your ball game right here. Lee Lacey with two outs and the bases jammed. But he pops out. So the Cubs are still in it. In the bottom of the sixth, trailing 4-1. Gary Matthews leads off with a walk. Gross. 1-7. That's a base hit through the hole where you're holding Matthews on. And you got runners on the corners. And here's your tie run, Glenn Becker. 38 is a 6-4-3 double. No, they brought it infield up. It's a 6-3 force out. And you have runners at second and third with one out. They brought it up for some reason. Jim Hickman. Second again. And with two outs, Billy Williams being filled. They move it back. And Billy Williams flies to right. So they don't get anything out of that. 4-1 in the seventh. Matty Alou. 45 center. Manny Sanguian, 45 short. And a lousy shortstop makes another error. Stargell against a lefty case. And with two outs, Clemente. That's a double single. Runners on the corners, Johnny Ray, Larry Gura. Hmm. I think Gura's gonna leave after inning in a third. Greg Harris will come on in the seventh. And face. Try and keep this game reasonable. Johnny Ray. Two outs, runners in the corners. Johnny Ray walks, and they're loaded for Al Oliver. 68 is a sky to right. All right, stretch time at Wrigley. Down 4-1. Root Roden having an exceptional start here. Bob to seven. Rick Roden. 1-4, that's a sky to left for Santo. Bob Dernier, sky to left. Randy Hundley, lines at first. Roden pumps his fist and turns the dugout with a 4-1 lead, moving to the eighth inning. Bob Robertson, 37, single one, two, 16's a base hit. Gene Alley, he's not, can't even let. Gene Alley, 6-4, three double play. And with two outs, Lacey again. 4-10 center, this is Dernier. Settles underneath it. All right. There's no... Well, you know what? I can bring in Hebner to play third base. Richie Hebner's going to play third base for Bob Roberts, and he's slightly better. We got six outs to go for Roden and their Pirate Pen. All right, here comes the number nine hitting shortstop, Gary Gstad, who has two errors today and is 0 for 2. 38, single 1 to 18 is a base hit. So there you go. Gary Matthews. Matthews, 5'10", is a strikeout. Gray Gross. And there you go. You got a base hit in the center field. Two on, and it's Becker. And now, um, yeah, Roden can't lose this game. So you break him, he comes out. It's first and second. He'll pitch to Becker. 48 pops to first. Two outs. It's Hickman. It doesn't really matter. Lefty or righty, he destroys both of them. 49, pops the second. Roden gets out of it. All right, ninth inning. Let's see. The ninth inning, we'll bring out, we'll have Dave Smith pitch the ninth inning. 
in a 4-1 game. He comes out, he faces Alou. 1-7, that's gonna be a base hit for Matty Alou. Sangian, 2-6, double one of three, single. You got runners on the corners, and Stargell, up and hold. Dave Smith is at least good about uh, getting lefties out here. Let's take a look at the Smith card to show that. So here's Stargell against Smith, who's good against lefties. They bring the infield up. Sky to right, though. This looks like a sack fly attempt. Alou against Hickman. It's going to be 1 to 16. And he's thrown out at the plate on a 20. Thrown out the plate on a 20. Tough double play. Pirates can't seem to put these Cubs away. Runner at first, two outs, Clemente. Sky's a left. This is Billy Williams in left field. And he makes the catch. Hey, Cubs! Still got a shot. 4-1. And Roden is still out there. They just don't trust their bullpen. They got a decent bullpen, not a great one. So, Billy Williams will start off the ninth inning, down 4-1. And 3-10 is a walk. One more batter will break Roden and get him out of the game. Ron Santo. 38. That is a 6-4-3 double play. Tough break for the Cubs. They just... Have Frustrating afternoon. Rhodes been putting guys on base, but they're not scoring them. And there's two outs in the ninth. Dernier, base hit. Now, we're going to hook Roden here. He's broken. And we got a three run lead. It'd be nice to get the complete game, but Pirates are down 3 2 in the series. They just want the W at this point. So they're going to go with their closer, Dave Yusty. Take a look at that card. All right, so you got a runner at first. Actually, you don't. Dernier's just gonna run a second. So his run is meaningless. So in the ninth inning, Justy's gonna face Randy Hunley. A runner on second, two outs. Randy Hunley, the pitch. 59 is a bouncer to second. This is Johnny Ray, it's a base hit. Ray cannot make a play on it. Now you got runners on the corners. And it's Jerry Justad again. He hits righties pretty well. Runs on the corners with two outs. 49, rolls a second base, and the game's over. Couldn't do it. So Justy does get the easy save, and the Pirates will force a game seven in Wrigley Field. Let's take a look at the standings here. Dave Smith in the ninth, gave up two hits. Great Harris pitched an inning in the third. Gave up hitting a walk. Larry Gura gave up, hit a walk and a K, two hits, a walk and two Ks, and Sanderson, everything else, takes a loss. He had nine hits and four runs, all in those middle innings, all were earned, walked nobody, struck out one. Justy gets the save, gave up a hit to Hunley. And everything else is uh, Roden, almost an almost complete game. I just, for safety, took him out. Gave their closer an easy save. Nine, eight and two thirds, eight hits, one earned run, walk three, struck out three. Nice line. And the series is tied up. 1019, 0109, 41414. By the way, the music you've been listening to is The Intruders. The Intruders. 1019, 0109. Okay, let's see what they're. Uh, pretty cool series. Home teams won the first four games, road teams won the next two, and we'll have a game seven in Wrigley Field. So, year to date, the Pirates, boy, they really have struggled. Here's their year to date numbers between the, between the Pirates. And the Cubs. Okay. So we migrate the stats and take a peek here. So year to date, the Cubs are seven and eight. They're hitting 290 with a 302 team ERA. They just had some bad luck, it looks like. And the Pirates, they're six and nine. They're hitting 275 with a 437 ERA. The Reds are seven and four and are leading the division. And that's it. Thank you for watching. I will ch check in again soon.